Greetings, friend. I will show you how to solve possible classic for Sudoku Grand Prix by Yoshi Baroshi by placing marks in the grid. Click on the link below if you want to try it yourself. And with that, it's solving time. Okay, the thing I noticed is there's kind of a, a trick right here. You see this 278 and this 349, those are different um, three digits. Well, the 278 can't be in these three spots. So the 278 actually has to be in that spot right there, right? And then of course we can get rid of the seven and we can get rid of the eight. And what that leaves us with is a one, five, six. You see there's a one, six right there. So that's a five and this is gonna be a one, six. Um, there, this is real common uh, type technique because now we're gonna be able to solve most of the rest of the columns four, five, and six, or at least put some digits in there. So now you see this three, four, nine kind of does the same thing. It has to be in these three cells. There's a four and nine right there. So that's a three and that's a four and a nine. Hopefully you're seeing what I'm seeing. And so that leaves this one, five, six in these three spots. One, five, six, and we can get rid of the one there and we can get rid of the five there. And so it leaves, so the two, seven, eight, two, seven, eight. So now your two, seven, eight's right here. And we can get rid of that seven. And then you see the one, five, six has to be right here. One, five, six. And that gets rid of the five. And then this is gonna be your three, four, nine. You see the four, nine right there. So that's a three and that's a four, nine. Okay, I'm pretty sure Yoshi wanted you to find that because that's kind of fun. All right, from there, now we're gonna kind of stretch on a little bit more and see uh, look at some of these cells. See if there's some uh, hidden singles, naked singles, because I haven't even like done any kind of cross hatching yet. Um, one thing I noticed: you got a five, five, and a five, so that's a five, and then you have the four and the four, so that's a four. Okay. And what that does now: this nine's coming across, and so you have a pointing pair of nines right the nines have to be in these two spots so they can't be in any of these two spots here and they can't be up there so that's a nine right there and so now you have a two uh, eight there's an eight so that's got to be a two and here's an eight and so now i can get rid of this eight the other thing i gotta remember there's no auto removal of the candidates so it's all manual for me and so if i mess that up and i mess that up and hopefully i don't i want to give you a good quality puzzle to solve okay uh, so I filled out that stuff, fours and the fives. Uh, let's see the other impact. So five, five, this has to be a five right there. And so now the five's right here. And so this is gonna be a one, six naked pair, sweet. Um, where else do I see restrictions? Let's look across, I'm gonna look across row seven here. What do we got? Five, six, seven, eight, so this is a, Six, seven, eight. I'm gonna get away from Snyder a little bit. Five, six, seven. Oh, that's actually an eight. Great. And so that's not an eight. And so five, six, six, seven, and five, six, seven. So they could triple. Okay. Um, and what I'm noticing actually, okay, five, seven here and five, seven there. Well, the fives and sevens are in these two spots. So that's that can't actually be a six. This has to be a five, seven, naked pair. Sweet. Okay. Well, that gives me some uh, more to work with. So now, what does that tell me with this five, seven? Is there anything else I can uh, solve with that? So now the six comes down, and so the six is a pointing pair. It has to be in one of those two spots. Well, since it's a pointing pair, that is no longer six, that's a one. And if that's a one, that can't be one. And now you have a five, six pointing pair right there. Okay, cool. And so now you got this one, one, this is not a one, and that's a one. All right, I like it. We're making some progress here. And so now you got five, seven, five, seven. Well, this is actually now a two, four, six naked triple. And so you see the six there. So two, four, six, two, four, six. I will get rid of that six, but this can't be a four anymore. So that's a nine, that's a four. All right, I like the logic. So two, four, six. Where are we missing a three and an eight? I see an eight up in column three. So there's your three and there's your eight. Okay, sweet. So we got the fives, we got the eights, and now I limited the two spots here. 
And then the threes, what can I do with the threes? Uh, not much more really with the threes. All righty, um, I'm, I am digging this. Um, let's look at column three here, what, what's missing? We're missing a two, we're missing uh, a two, six, nine. Okay, so this has to be six, nine. This would be a two, six. And what do we have down here? Looks like two, six, nine. So I will mark that. Um, and I'm also looking, what other restrictions can I find here? Uh, five, eight, nine. Okay, so eights have to be one of those two spots. Does that affect this column? No, nope. but I mean, it's at least good to know. All right, and then the fives, okay, the sevens uh, could be, you know, this is a seven, this is a seven. So sevens can be one of those two spots. I'll just make those marks. Uh, what else do I see? Three, okay, nines. Okay, I can actually solve for a nine right here because of column seven and nine and row six. Good. And so let's look at column eight now. We got two, uh, two, three, four, it looks like. That's three. So this is a two. So I can solve this for a three. That's the only place left for a three. And there's a four right there. So that's a two. And that's four. And now we got, I can get rid of the uh, fours. And so you got a two, six, and a naked pair. Okay, and good. Now we have the three across here, so now three has to be one of these two spots. All right, I like it. I like it a lot. All right, uh, again, I'm just looking for those restrictions. I'm getting a lot across row six now. What am I missing? Uh, this can't be a two anymore, so we'll get rid of that two. So we're looking at a one, six, seven, eight. Uh, so that's a one, seven, eight right there. Seven eight one seven, so that's a six eight, and you can still got the seven, so a one six eight, and it doesn't really give us much, but I marked it down. Okay, what other restrictions are we seeing? So I'm kind of like scanning my way around. I notice there's a lot of by value cells coming across row four, that's interesting to me. Um, when we finish off block seven while we're at it. So we need two, six, seven, nine. So you have two, nine there. So that's a six, seven, and that's good because now we have a naked pair, six, seven, six, seven. So this can't be a six, it's gotta be a two, nine now. All right, so two, nine. And so two, nine, two, nine, six, seven, five, six, seven. So there's a naked triple and a naked pair cutting across. But we're able to eliminate a candidate from that spot. Okay, that's good, that's good. Um, what I want to look at now, I think, would be, let's finish up here in block three first. Okay, we miss a one, we got a one, so two, four, seven, eight, eight's cutting across. So that's what I'm seeing, two, four, seven. Okay, uh, two, four, seven, eight. Yeah, it's also a two, four, seven. Hey, maybe not really gonna get much here. Uh, the fours are now you know limited to those two spots. I can make a mark like that. And this is a uh, two seven eight. And this is two seven eight. Yeah, I didn't really get much fruit from that guy. Uh, I got to do better. Except that this is now a naked triple two seven eight two seven eight and two seven. So that means that two seven eight can't be over here anymore. Uh, but we kind of knew that because it's two seven eight is already in that block. But what does that mean for the rest of us? We got a one, three, six, nine. Uh, this is gonna be a one, three, six, and this could be a one, three, six, nine. One, three, six, nine. And this has to be a one, six, because I already see a three, nine across the row. So two, one, six, one, six, two, four, seven. Okay, well, that's making sense. Um, getting a little bogged down though. I'm not really seeing the, making the progress I thought I was gonna make. What do we have the rest of column seven here? All right, we got a one, two, three, five, seven, nine. So four, six, eight could be right there. Yeah, yeah. So let's do four, six, eight. Okay. Oh, this nine right here has been staring me in the face because that's four and that's nine. And so that can't be a four anymore. Oh my goodness. How long has that been there? Oh my goodness, people. I am a little off because that would create 
a four right there, which is huge. That's huge. Because now we have a six, eight naked pair. If that's a six, eight naked pair, that can't be a eight anymore. And this can't be a six, so that's a two. And that's your six. Oh, nice. And since that's a two, now we have a seven and a four. And now we can tell you that's a two and we got an eight. Oh, man. And since that's, uh, we already got an eight and a six, that has to be a one now. And we can solve the last. This is there three, but the five, seven, we can't do anything with yet. Oh, man. Yep, I just didn't see that. Okay, one. So you get rid of this one, and what you'll see here is you have a seven, eight, seven, eight. So that means that has to be a six, that has to be an eight. Uh, okay. And then so now we got an eight here. This can't be an eight anymore. So two, seven. Yep, the two sevens and eights. Slim those out a bit. Cool. All right. Now we're getting near the, I think we're getting near the part where it's just going to pop. Uh, so what is it? Then I'm missing fives, seven. I'm looking, I'm just kind of scanning across, uh, working at threes. B, threes gonna be right there. Okay, I feel like there's enough that I can solve. I'm just not seeing the right combination yet. Five, seven, two, seven, eight. Okay, let me look here. Uh, let's just finish off what we got. A one, two, six, seven. So. Uh, that's a one, one, six, seven. Uh, that, well, that can't be an eight anymore. So that has to be your eight. That's what I was missing. Eight, three. And now this has to be a three. Sweet. Okay, we can get rid of the three here. And a three there. We got a more of a one, six, nine thing going on. That's a two. That is a six, that's a one, that's a six. And the puzzle's starting to fall apart. You got a seven, got an eight, we got a seven. Uh, one, six, seven, that's gotta be your one, that's gotta be your uh, two that we haven't seen yet. And now we come down here, remember we got that nine, two combo going on, sweets, and so we got a six, so this has gotta be your nine. And we got a one, six, uh, or we are got a one in there, so that's a six. That's a one, we'll finish this off six seven and this is gonna be your six that'll be your five that'll be your seven this will be your five all righty that's your two that's your seven here's your one there's your six puzzle solve if you want to see more solving like this check out one of these other videos thank you yoshi broshi for letting me feature your puzzles on this channel you're a great setter thank you all so much for watching